Good morning, Candace. What's so great about it? Not much. We can't find Perry anywhere. He's never missed breakfast, not even once. Uh, you don't think he could have argued with someone at, say, 3.38 a.m., gone his feelings hurt, then run away, do you? Nah, he never would have gone outside on purpose. Everybody knows platypuses are supposed to stay inside at night. You haven't seen him anywhere, have you? Well, maybe he just wandered off. Doesn't he always wander off at some point in the day? And then later when he comes back, you say, oh, there you are, Perry, and he says, Yeah, but he's always here in the morning. I'd be devastated if something happened to him. Coming. Another gift basket? We regret to inform you that due to the regurgitator's recent evil behavior, you have been downgraded to a minor threat. If you believe this to be a mistake, please fill out the included appeal for- A minor threat? Regurgitator? Oh, well, there's a lot of weirdos out there. Oh, here we go. He has his own blog. World's most evil villain. Wait, who does this upstart think he is? It's time to show him who's boss. All right, Ferb. Activate the Plat Attractor 3000. If Perry's anywhere in Danville, this'll bring him home. Wow. I didn't know there were so many platypuses in Danville. Yeesh, what a dump. Feel so much for Mr. Big Shot Super Villain. Uh, yeah, hi. I'm looking for someone named Mr. The Regurgitator. Push. Eh. Oh, my Heinz Heine. Look at this, all this technology, a giant vacuum tube, and they can't afford a throw pillow? Oh, hello. I am the regurgitator! Well, okay, my name is Heinz Doofenshmirtz. Ta-da! I'm sorry, I don't have the heart. Where are those lights coming from, by the way, when you do that? You're that disturbed lunatic from Danville. Oh, you've heard of me. Yes, and you've heard of me! Seriously, where's that coming? Oh, look, you've already captured Perry the Platypus. My, you do work fast. Why don't you fill out these forms and I'll consider you for a three-year internship. I am not here to apply for an internship. Ooh, you offer maternity leave. You can start by making a fresh pot of coffee. No, Ferb, not Perry. This little guy's eyes are too close together and his beak is orange. Perry's is more of a tangerine. Nope, too fat. Too thin. Too cartoony. Whoa, that one smells like meatloaf. Perry! Perry the platypus! Be huh? Perry! Get over here. You're coming home with me so I don't get in trouble with the... You have a pet beaver? You have a pet platypus. Touché. Nope, too blue, too angular, too French. That one's just a duck with a beaver tail taped on him. Well, that was the last of them. Maybe we need to think bigger. And with music. Perry just loves music, remember? Let's get the guitars. I've got an idea. There's 104 days of summer vacation And school comes along just to end it So the annual problem for our generation is finding a good...